It's kind of the dawning of the age of Aquarius. Isn't yeah, it's, it's the first rock musical. It was. Kind of, yeah, it yeah, yeah. kind of broke barriers back then, mm -hmm. and still today. And it and it touches on so many important kind of things, such as equality, racism, gay rights, and war. And we're still fighting for that now. So ahead of its time, though. So ahead of its time. Really ahead of the its songs, time. like you say, Aquarius. Let the, the sunshine in. Oh, let the sun. Of yeah, course. what a tune. Like, I know. and it's just such an honour to be able to get the role kind of thing, yeah. Good for you, because you auditioned, you got the role. Yep. Um, did you know when you auditioned that you would have to be Bear Scuddy? Um, <laughs> I kind of heard, but I don't know if you've seen my Instagram, I'm not shy, do you know what no, I mean? No, you're not. There's, we've got evidence, look. That, that's not naked. That, that is you naked. You made that look naked. We put that L on. Pants on there. Can I say that L is not for little, that L is for large? <laughs> Just in case you're worried. Who's edited me pants on? <laughs> I had pants on in that, I'm not joking. No, you didn't. Um, <laughs> Do you know what? The, the naked scene is what a lot of people know it for. Indeed. But it's got a huge meaning in it about standing together and yeah. about the freedom. It's and... not just gratuitous. No, you have like, to, I'm not, you know. not going to be running around with it in the crowd. Do you no, know no, what no, I mean? no, 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 no. That would be weird. That would... But it's about, it's about the freedom of it and about all sticking together. And it's such an amazing show. It's a great show. The cast, I've, I've made bonds that I'll, will last a lifetime. And you say that a lot when you go on reality TV, like, we're all the best of friends. But no, but something like this is This different. is just totally different. you've all got to have each other's backs. Yeah, and yeah. there's no competition. Everybody wants everyone to do well. Yeah. So for me to come out of reality TV and them, them lot take me serious is amazing because like you said, I've worked really hard behind the scenes with acting lessons and with singing lessons, and now I get a chance to go and on tour with a musical. It's great. It's it's and the perfect part for me, I get to play George Berger, who is kind of the leader of the tribe, a bit of a loose cannon, mm -hmm. a bit like myself. Uh huh. <laughs> uh, I take my trousers off in the first two minutes and might, throw them at someone in the might crowd. Might as well get it over with. Get it over Get and it over. With. You're not naked the whole time. No, no. <laughs> it, the, 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 naked, the naked bit is like a literal like five seconds. Right. So you won't even be able to find mine. <laughs> like, it's not happening. Uh -huh. Put your cameras away. I think you will. <laughs> <laughs> but, but it's like like I said, the show is incredible. The cast is amazing. Jonathan, who's the director, is just Look at you as a hippie. Do you like it? Yes, I do. I, I think, think it's great. I, I think, think it's really looks good. All right. Yeah. I think it looks and all you right. have worked really hard. I guess the dream would be this gets transferred to the West End. Be, that would be lovely. Or yeah. you do a West End show. I am astounded that nobody's ever approached you to be Billy in Chicago. It seems to be an absolute no brainer. That could be the next one. That could you be the next know. one. I just think you would be so good at that. Yeah. I'm, um, it's, it's been quite a transition into musical theatre from yeah. reality TV and stuff. Like, the hours are long and it's a lot of work and the lines like I'm uh, but you I've got love the scripts it. like this but honestly you love it I love it of course you do it's amazing now look we love you on this show and you oh. do lots of things for us and on Valentine's Day do you remember Prince, Prince the Penguin was looking for love well breaking news did he get lucky breaking news he did with hyacinth oh that's the one that they said that yes mostly... Prince and hyacinth have exchanged pebbles and basically that means they're engaged I should open a date, a penguin dating show. Yeah. I gave him a little word of wisdom. You did. And he listened, and it's all going to be fine. And hopefully, you know, that was at the Birmingham Sea Life yeah. Centre, wasn't it? And hopefully for International Penguin Day, there might be a baby penguin. And hopefully he'll come watch the show in Birmingham. They, yeah. might, be, they might be shocked, though, to see you naked. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Not on a penguin suit. Yeah. Not on a penguin suit for him, and then you'll be up all right. To me so much. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, that's amazing. You've sorted see, that. See, this You're is like why judge, we do this job. We thought Judge Rinder was the, was the absolute cupid. It's you. This is why we do this job, Lorraine, <laughs> to make penguins all over the world happy. Well, do you know what? If you've made one penguin happy, you've done, you're I've doing done my fine. job. I've done my job. Jake, I wish you all the best. Thank with that. You so I really much. do. I know how hard you work. And I'll see you at press night. You betcha. 28. Oh, yes, I'll be there with my spyglass. Not that I'll need it. Need a telescope.